guys, welcome back to my channel, Nicole here. Today I am back with an updated what's in my bag, but this time with a work edition. For work, I am using, oh that's heavy, I am using this bag right here. This is a Tory Burch bag and I got it as a present from Arthur's parents. It's in this like beige, gray, I don't even know, taupe color and it has a cool design on it. I don't know what the actual um, name of the bag is itself, but I'll go ahead and link it in the description box and find it online for you guys. It's a big enough bag to fit my 15 inch laptop inside of, so that gives you some frame of reference for how large this bag actually is. It's got three pockets here. It's got a main middle pocket and then two side pockets. It's got short handles here so that you can wear it um, along your arm. And then it's also got a removable strap so that you can wear it on your shoulder as well. I love this bag. I love how structured it is. It's very, very professional looking. It's very um, muted, of course, in its color. And it's just a very good basic bag to wear to work on a daily basis. And it fits all of my stuff. Um, a lot of what's in here is new. I've got some oldies but goodies that you have seen in my last what's in my bag video, but a lot of this stuff is, again, brand new because I use this bag specifically for work, so it has a lot of my work stuff in it. Anyway, without further ado then, let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, in no particular order, I guess I will just start with the big pocket in the middle because I think that that's actually probably the only pocket that I use. The very first thing that I see in here is an umbrella. I've got a mini umbrella that I bought from Amazon. It's from the brand Crackajack. It's black and it's blue and I needed a mini umbrella that I could fit in my purse because it's been a little bit rainy here in LA and I hate when I need an umbrella and I don't have it on me because I left it you know, whatever, in my car, when I actually needed it in my office, or I needed it in my office when I actually left it at my house. It's just so frustrating to need an umbrella and not have one on you. So I bought a very, very small one on Amazon. This was pretty inexpensive, and it fits right in my bag. Next thing that I see in here is my small wallet. You guys remember this from my last What's My Bag tag. This is a Tory Burch wallet. It's black and gold. It's got my keys on it, my pepper small wallet, which carries, again, all of my essentials, like my ID and the credit cards that I use. But in addition to my small wallet, I do have a big wallet that carries all of my gift cards and my rewards cards and stuff like that. This wallet here is from Michael Kors. I got it for Christmas as a present for my uncle. Um, this is really where I've got all of my crap. It's got some pockets here for you to slip cards in and then it also has a zipper pocket for you to fit more crap inside and then in the front it has even more pockets and also on the back. So I can really fit a ton of crap in here. Next thing I see in my big pocket here is my cell phone. I have the iPhone 5S, 5, 6, I think this is a 6. I have the iPhone 6S. I've got a clear case on it that is so torn up and janky and broken from me dropping it so many times, but this janky little case has saved my phone from so many potential cracked screens, so totally worth it. If you don't have a case on your phone, get a case on your phone because it'll save you a ton of money. Next thing I see here is my laptop. So this is the IdeaPad Flex 4, so you can actually take the um, screen, I'll show you guys, demo this for you. So it opens up, but then you can actually flip it all the way around so that it becomes like, I don't know, like a giant iPad, pretty much. I actually never use my laptop like that, but it does that, it's touch screen, and I like it. Next thing that I see here is the charger for the laptop. So next thing that I see in the main pocket here are my Ray-Bans. These are my Ray-Bans. These are my daily wear sunglasses. I keep them in my work bag. They look like that. You guys have seen these in my last What's in My Bag. I'm obsessed with these Ray-Bans. So every time I lose them, I go pick up another pair. And then now in the main pocket, okay, now I'm moving into these little side pockets that have just little things in them. So let's just 
start with this pocket on the left. I have a checkbook. Um, I don't know why I find myself, I don't know, adulting, you know, you find yourself writing a bunch of checks. And so I just started to just keep the checkbook on me so that I can write checks whenever I need to. Next thing, I see my chapstick, Bird's Bees. Once my favorite, always my favorite. I can't get away from this, I'm addicted to it. I see a watch, this is actually my brother's watch. I have no idea what kind of watch this is. I'll ask him and if you guys are interested in it, I'll go ahead and put it in the description box. But it looks like it is a, I don't know, it just says citizen on there. It's got a really cool face. I don't even know why I'm going into so much detail about this watch, it's not even mine. It's my brother's, he asked me to hold it for him one day and I've just never given it back to him. So I've been meaning to do that, I gotta do that. I see a random piece of paper. Oh, it's a receipt, or not a receipt, but it's a, I guess it's kind of a receipt from Tiffany & Co. I have a infinity necklace that Arthur bought me and it got really, really badly tarnished. The cool thing is that Tiffany's will actually um, clean your jewelry for free. It's a complimentary service. So, and then I've got an envelope that I picked up from church to make a donation, so. I need to do that too. Okay, and then moving on to the pocket that's on the right side. First thing I see is a receipt from Vons. Next thing that I see in my bag is this lotion. I stole this. We didn't, I mean, I didn't steal it, but it came with um, the uh, hotel room that I stayed at at a conference that I went to in San Diego. Um, it was the Omni Resorts, and they had this rosemary and mint body lotion and it just smelled really good and so i went ahead and took it um from the hotel and now i just keep it in my bag as my like daily hand lotion next thing that i see is my business card holder i got this business card holder on amazon it's black and it's got a silver um i think it's actually like a mirror yeah silver mirror um i don't know embellishing at the bottom it's magnetic opens up like that. I keep my business cards in here and it's just, I like it because before I kind of just had my business cards laying around just willy-nilly in my bag, but this is sort of, I think, just a more professional way to present your business cards. Next thing that I see is a pen. You gotta have a pen on you. Two USB drives and a hair clip. A little, ooh! I've got a parking ticket. Skyview Center Garage, just a garage in LA. And then the two last things I see in this main pocket are my um, Renew contact solution and some ibuprofen. That is everything in the main pockets. I'm just going to really quickly see if I have stuff in the other pockets. So as you can see, the other two pockets open with like a magnetic, ah, with a magnet. And this one in the back is empty. The one in the front has a couple of envelopes. These just basically have expense checks in them and my pay stubs. And that is everything, guys. That is everything that is in my Tory Burch work bag. There's definitely more stuff in here than I expected there to be, but you know, it's a work bag. And so you gotta have everything on you because you never know what's gonna happen. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. I'm putting out new videos every single week. Okay, guys, I'll see you in my next one. Bye!